life inside me. I don't admit that I'm feeling down. The moment that it starts to leave me, the darkest colors will shine in my crown. It was like uh, we jammed. It in. was summer of 2019. Yeah, yeah it was last summer. So it's like April or something. No, so it wasn't that early. Are we like well, next June? Day, maybe June. I mean, obviously we're better, but are we like? It's crazy different. It's definitely different. I don't say it's crazy different, but it is different. You yes. got a tighter Our sound. Self. You've moved. You've moved into a sound. Like you've That's kind of figured that out. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's. I don't know how you guys feel about it. I mean, you're the sound engineer, you know. Yeah, but you play the music, and this is your interview. <laughs> I would say that his shit's getting like you found a pattern. There's, there's, uh, there's a direction we're taking now, definitely. And that's I mean, your, there's, there's a flow. It's your writing. But the, the lyrics are coming out just like. The, the music is coming out just so easy and then the lyrics are layering on top of it and then so easy you, you know I, I, Jen even with like the pop song that we're doing the pleasant pop bass you know she, I was like but I, it was a groove it sounded yeah, good yeah, yeah, it I wasn't agree. Latin feeling and oh, then I wish she didn't slap bass did she not slap the bass she did and I asked her about it afterwards did she get slapped and, I, and I listened to our recordings from that last night before we played and the slap bass was really cool on that mm -hmm. song. Oh. But she didn't do it then, actually? She didn't no. do it. She should have. Yeah. That she would have made her a lot cooler. But, I mean, even sad. like, the, the more I get used to your lyrics and us playing it, um, 
just like you said, I mean, lyrics is just another layer of music. It is. Mm -hmm. It is. It's all just layers. All of it is. I like where your head's at, though, man. I don't know, whatever vibe you're feeling. That's, that's what I'm talking about. Like, when we first started, you brought some stuff from the past, like, uh, Voices. I think it's yeah. a past song, and like, like All the King's Clothes might have been an old song, and you yeah. might have attached different vibes to those than what I felt. But the new stuff, I feel like it's like, and I love those too, but like, man, where you're going is like, fuck, I'm like, where's this gonna go? It's gonna be fucking dynamic. And some of those vibes too, I mean, like, I remember writing the lyrics to those songs, and since we've been playing them so much, and, and uh, finally performing them live and stuff. Uh, I've totally forgotten about how I've written them and the lyrics that I wrote, which is a good thing, because it means like it's in a better direction, or it's just a different, uh, yeah, a different song, which I guess makes it so hard. Yeah. yeah, but do you remember if, like, when we were in here? Nothing's better than playing year, with well, other people. Yeah, I think like, we actually, that, that's how you grow as a musician. True. Yeah, that's how you grow lyrically. Yeah, in I front mean, of people or with people, just different people. And both. Yeah. I mean, yeah. but especially with people. I mean, just like with me playing with Josh and I, you know? Yeah. I mean, it's, I, I don't do that just because I think we're going to click and right. do that. I do it because it makes me grow and I get tempo down, as you know, <laughs> fucking tempo problems here. Me too. Yeah, me yeah. too. But at the same time, it's like, that. I think we're, we're almost, we're almost too strict on that. Yeah. Not quite. No, I don't. I don't know. I don't think you're too strict on that. You're probably right in that ballpark. Sounds like we weren't on Friday. Well, how much you had to drink before you played? We didn't really drink much before we played. Yeah. So. Well, we have a shot. And a beer. Shot in a cold snack. I mean, we were mm. pretty fucking dialed in, as far as we were concerned. Dude, I was, I was ready, man. Yeah. I had enough adrenaline flowing through me. I was, but it was, it was. It was good. It was good. That was a good show. I think we can get four or five more if we want to. I found myself in the dark Within the walls of a cave and Still unsure of how I got here Or how the surrounding walls became my world and my home Spinning madly in the dark Something better, or could have known that the journey would end up here.
talking about wine. We always have two drinks in our hands. Why are you Canadian? Ah, uh, well, we went over this that Friday. <laughs> <laughs> You're never gonna get over that question, are you? No, I suppose not. That's a fucking life. Bomb. So Vancouver, Unless I'm in Canada, Vancouver, are you, are you from an island out there? Mm. So you're Samoan. Which, yeah, I'm Samoan. Um, no. <laughs> Wrong island, bud. <laughs> but I was born you're on Eskimo. Island. I was born on uh, Vancouver Island. That's know. probably the coolest island, dude, in Canada. Mm -hmm. Which which island is it? It's the only <laughs> island in Canada. Is it? It's the only island yeah. that's inhabited. Well, I count New Finland. That's not an island. It's more of a peninsula. It's more of it's a got islands, coastal. Though. But yeah, uh, yeah. It's more like Colorado. Colorado. You have to take a ferry to get to where I'm going. So did you ski up on uh, Black? Blackcomb. Blackcomb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, they, they had the Winter Olympics there. Mm -hmm. Fuck yeah. When was that? Dude, I went on that fucking ski jump. That was 10 jump, years ago. That, that thing where it ramps down and whatever, whatever they call that the ski jump. Yeah. Where they Big go air? for like, yeah. Dude. You did that? Well, fucking hiked up and looked down. I was like, no way. Ain't, ain't. You didn't do it? No. <laughs> no. Man. No way I would ever do that. I mean, it's fucking like straight down and into Never Never Land, like gone. Death. <laughs> into the abyss. Yeah, I mean, they write it off, you're dead. <laughs> but no, they, they actually, they left, uh, so in Whistler Village, it's Blackcomb Whistler, and Whistler's the town. Mm -hmm. They left uh, the rings and all that shit. Yeah. So if you, we have a condo up there. That's where my parents live. After we moved out, but um, so when we go back with the kids, they can get the, the bobsleds and all that shit. They put them around the city. Mm -hmm. It's kind of cool. Yeah, we spent some time in uh, Vancouver after that. It's and they had those big place. buildings and the big awesome. crab and all that. It's after the Olympics. After the Olympics, yeah. It's a fantastic city. You I talk love, about you talk about music. I scene? would I would live there Man. if if I could afford it. Yeah, it's expensive. Being not Canadian she can't be any more expensive than air. I, well, I'm yeah. not Canadian, so you have to go. Well, it. here's the problem with you is you're not going to be allowed to cross the border. Yeah, so I mean, I'm not Canadian. <laughs> I can't <laughs> let like you across the border. <laughs> I can sketch you State lines. <laughs> Except for I've been, I've been across more borders than all of you combined, so. Legally? Uh-huh. Yeah, I doubt it. <laughs> Weren't you a SEAL operative? Nope. <laughs> Never been in the Navy <laughs> SEALs, and that's, a, that's on video. <laughs> <laughs> we talk about a fucking music scene. Like, they had a great music scene. We were in British Columbia. Yes, all of that. Yeah, you've been to New York, right? A little bit. You've been to New York, so you know when you go, you walk down the street and just go down some steps and go into a place, and that music scene is fantastic. Yeah. Like that kind of deal where you walk into any bar and on any given. That's how, that's how Austin is in Texas. Austin's definitely Austin. that way. Yeah, I mean, they're they're the second mecca, of, or I guess third, I mean, of, of just or music. What would be the top three? Then? Top three, you've got New York. Obviously. Nashville. Um, obviously. Yeah. L.A. And then Austin. And then Austin. I can see that. You would say Austin, or L.A. is better than Austin? No, I'm just saying those are the top four. Oh. I don't know how they fall in I would order. Say Austin's got to be. Austin's great. I would say L.A., Austin, yeah. then Nashville, then probably fucking New, New York. York. Well, I don't no, know. New, New York, York is. I mean, you got you got a zillion people out of New York. You know? Yeah, if they, you go by population, New York's number one. It depends but, on the type of music too. Yeah. yeah. I mean, Nashville's not gonna have the bluesy, jazzy shit. That I actually, they're getting more that way right really? here. Yeah, I've got some buddies that live out there. Here, it's getting more. More bluesy, I'm sure more... you could break that down into genres too. I mean, like Miami, you know, you've got your more hip hop and uh, more hip hop, uh, reggae se tone uh, type senior, stuff. Senior citizen living, you know, all that stuff. By the way, if you guys yeah. want to go to Miami, Marty's there for a month for work. What's he do again? He works for RTC, it's a company in town. Okay. But they do restoration and they've had a bunch of shit down there, right? With all the hurricanes. Hurricane oh, shit. So yeah. he's down. He said he's more in Alabama, I think, but right there. Oh, there yeah, is. That's not far. I got so ready to send me a beach pick, which I thought was the gayest thing to have done, but whatever. Who's he in the speedo? Not up here. <laughs> he's he's, he's got his tender travel mode on right now. Trying right. to figure out what's going on here. He's <laughs> off the beach with the sun. Right, uh huh. Uh huh. Anyway. Yeah, got it. Never mind. Um, well, uh, you can't rule out Seattle either. 
Seattle's like that's the grunge capital of the world right there. I mean that's that's where a lot of I think so bands are need, gonna or, uh, resurface there. if they can get through all their political bullshit. It'll it'll come back. Not to bring up politics. <laughs> How dare you on a music I'm so theme glad channel? I'm so glad we haven't gone that way. You know what? I'll be Political? honest, like, it's so easy. In time. Yeah, right but... now, in this day, it's so easy it's to be political. And maybe people feel it's a need. It's like, yeah. there's so much other shit in life other than just that. As long as you're aware of it, you probably won't ever go down that road. We're at that age, though, where people take it so serious. It's ridiculous. Like, my best, so, a couple of my, we were talking about this earlier. We were, yeah. yeah. A couple of my best friends are just hell bent on anything that anybody says and it just attacks them and I'm just like hey come up and fucking play some music with me right let's go fish yeah. right get away golf get Whatever. away do something yeah. other than disconnect the from world. what you're just hypercharged to I don't agree with you man 100% get hypercharged to something that makes you feel good that makes you happy There's that's what I think music well, it's, it's, you... it's the it's the yeah. universal connector, and it really, yeah. really is. I think it's a way to vent. Like, if you're angry about politics, you want to spread a message. That's cool. That's how punk but rock. Let it kind go of with that, right? Yeah. Once you're, once you're, you're, like, go do something else. Like, you can't just constantly vent. You can't constantly be angry. Yeah. Oh, it's it's worse for Rage Against the Machine. Well, but they're, I bet, I bet they're <laughs> that's, pretty, that's their, that's their, that's yeah, I bet they're, they're pretty chill their, in between their fucking Oh, yeah, game, they're, you they're know? like, yeah. They're probably, they write shit because they're angry and they're pissed and they vent. You get it they, out. And then they go fucking chill. And it's like, people need to learn how to, that, that segment yeah. of chill is Chill is gone. gone. No one knows, no one Netflix and chill anymore. It's all I guess just, it's Facebook though, right? Facebook and social media. I think and, Facebook's like, probably the biggest call for everything is. Porn. But, all of it. D all the others with double D all JDK's <laughs> tattoo dog. Hey, don't just the tattoos. You know you like them. No matter how do you JDK sport out the tattoo, bro. I've got them both. You've already seen Robin. Them. Yeah. Then that's good, man. way cool. Pretty good. Yeah. It hurt like shit though. Is that like the underbelly of the arm? This right here, the ears and the nose, I passed out twice. <laughs> 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 and that is on camera. Um, and known by many people. Dude, known by many people. That is so awesome that you passed out twice. I passed out twice. Don't worry, I got this. No, I was just... He's like, I gotta stop for a minute. I'm like, why? He's like, you're about to pass out. I'm like, no, I'm fine. I'm fine. And then everything just goes black. <laughs> He's like, I stopped. This is my 15th tattoo, man. I got it. <laughs> Andy, we need to get you a tattoo for I got a buddy who'll do it. I'm ready. I got a buddy who'll do it. Where, where are you gonna get one? If you if you could get any tattoo, right where would it be and what right would it be? Right there, run the areolas. I, 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 I want, yeah, I want a nipple tattoo that says, <laughs> fuck you. No, I want so what of your penis something up. Something on the mid-back. It's going to say, it's going to Callaway or Ping? Or no, no, no. I want, I actually, <laughs> Morrison Hotel. You know, honestly, I've always been waiting for something that, that I want to see every day. Why not your kids? You see them every day. No, but I, I see them, them every day. Like, that's the point. Like... Like, you won't like let's say let's day. say you fucking do you won't something. You see them every day. They'll grow up and move away. No, nah, but the, the, the essence of the child is still there. It's, it's, it's what it's that person. That just saying. But like, as far as a tattoo, it's I think that's a personal thing. You're not trying. Oh, to, definitely. You're not trying to send a message to anyone else, but yourself. And so I'm waiting for that. Uh, uh, Midnight for now. I, I can I'll see you drunk when it's gonna happen. No, I want angel I want, wings. Something more. Of, Honestly, more, it's gonna sound stupid, but more zen, more like, don't fucking sweat it, it's gonna be cool. You know, in and, and, and better to, terms, but like something. You need to go visit my tattoo guy. And then on the other side of that, like, hey, fucking, this is pretty cool. So, like, if MFN did go and we had some songs that were really awesome, having something that was like, fucking look at what we did. It's MFN time with a muffin right there. Right, yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. That's actually, that's it's your next it's album right there. <laughs> MFN, it's MFN <laughs> time so with a muffin right in the middle. Amazing. Yeah. Like that, that's amazing. That's the next album cover right however, there. However, <laughs> he needs to tighten the drums. <laughs> I, I, will, I will draw that for I'll draw that out. I'll draw a big muffin for you. Uh, yeah. No, I, I don't know. It's a good question. And tattoos mean a lot of things to a lot of different people. I think it's incredibly important. Yeah, I put I put a lot of thought purpose in it. To me. 
to it. If you put think, you put a lot of thought into them, then it makes makes sense to do it. So but if you get drunk and you just go get a tattoo, then it's like, that's cool too, though, man. I that's cool of, too, I but get, like, like the sleeves. You, like, you don't remember what it is though. If you've been drunk and you, yeah. and that is a lot of tattoo artists. So, so tattoo in, if you're drunk. In the past year, past year, what what has been your motivation to build your studio here? Or what's been your motivation to build your tattoos? What's been your what's been your drive? Porn. This that might is. be yours, bud. <laughs> I mean, obviously, you're married, like, obviously, obviously, it's, obviously it's your kids. Oh yeah, I my mean, kids are a huge part of everything. They're they're I mean, a part I think of that's, everything I do. That that I think that's all ours. I mean, oh, Liliana is just like, you know, that's. I, lo I love the look she gave me yesterday, though. Yeah, that was that was quite comical. That was funny. I, he was riding his bike out in the neighborhood. Now I pulled up and I was just like, hey, what the hell are you doing out here? I'm like, I'm riding my bike. And she's just like, daddy, just keep driving. Yeah, <laughs> <She can't laughs> creeper. Uh, yeah. Daddy, it's the guy from the sign. It's the guy from the sign. Uh, I don't yeah. like it. Look, it look of his bike he's riding on. Is that what she said? No. Oh, I can see that. You, you do? Look. But whenever I yelled at you. To yeah, he daddy, yells at me as he's driving down the road. Like, I'm like <laughs> And then I was just like, daddy, that's not <laughs> you do look like a guy that would steal somebody's purse, so it's fine. It's beard. <laughs> Don't be jealous of the beard. But it's compensation. The beard is compensation <laughs> for what's missing up here. Looks like you get um, your purse back. You get it back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, you, instead of it coming right in, it's going to be Trump, you <laughs> call this <laughs> over. <laughs> if I was Trump, I would do a lot of things differently. Uh, anywho, no politics. <laughs> we're moving forward. Um, the motivation, it's its all music based. It's just music creation. You got to keep it analog over here? What? It's going to be majority will be analog probably for a long time. We're ready to do it, man. Yeah, analog is so much more Marshall fun. or somebody over here that can play drums and tune them. And if he, if he doesn't do tune it. those, those are in tune. If he yeah. doesn't, he just plays them. We're, we're good. I think we need to. Do I could tell whenever I pulled up and you're playing them over here. And I, I was just like, that sounds. That sounds, like well, a, we played. that sounds like a good kick drum. I yeah. think we need to do five to seven songs. That might be a little much at the beginning. No, I just mean like right now. Like like not. Right now, right now? Like I'm in this map. Add two or three, but then keep adding two or three. And then replace like we need to get rid of that Dom. We need to get rid of Rise. We need to get rid of Bongos. All that shit that we did with with Me? beads. Beads? Like, you don't like Rise? I love it, but it's changed. I think, I think you should redo re, redo Rise. Yeah, Rise is different. Rise Freedom, is, Freedom Road, I think, is a heavy song. I mean, it's like it's you know, way better now than it was then. Let's play Rise after this. I fucking yeah. I listen to Freedom Road. I, I, I actually or even did that. Freedom Road. We I listened to Freedom Road then, Road. and I listened to Freedom Road from the night before we played, and I was like, it's a different fucking song. Yep. But yeah, why not? As he walks off to the bathroom. But like, you know, like it's, it's, I don't know. Things change over time. I agree. But not, not necessarily like, <laughs> I don't know, like as, as far as we didn't change. We oh, added, but you did. We, no, but I think we added parts and the parts <laughs> changed us. So it's not like, that's the cool part, right? No, it can be. So we didn't like. It wasn't somebody strong arming something saying this is the way it's gonna sound oh, yeah, from here right, to fucking right. A to B, right? It's it's the parts came in and I wonder if we can hear him pee. <laughs> On camera. <laughs> sure, sure sounds like it's a long way from the water, bud. Did you uh, close the door when you were doing that? You know we're still recording, right? Yeah. <laughs> Anywho. <laughs> Anyway, but no, like, you're right. Definitely music, even just making music changes. Well, let's play some music. Changes you. Come on, play some. But not even, it's it's not even, it's the idea of his melody. And you add layers and fucking up. A year ago that... It's all changed. It's all different. Well, it's changed, but it's also because the names have changed.
find my way in the beauty of each day. You took it all back. Yeah, you covered me up. Oh, I turned me around. But your chains are weak. My spirit is strong. I'll survive. Thank you. 
Oh